house and barroom became a voice for individuals who were disenfranchised, rejected, and dejected from their family homes. For many people in the house and barroom scene, the houses became who they were. I just think that so many queer youth could benefit from this world of ballroom. It's a place where you can come and you feel safe. And I would say like it's like a shopper. You kind of shopping your tools and creativity and discover things in you that you didn't even know existed, like your talents. And it can just take them so much further than they are and just give them a place to feel they truly belong. Pop the beat. Ball culture, ballroom culture. It's a place where a lot of LGBT community members, they go to, they find refuge, they find comfort, they get to be who they truly want to be, and they just get to live their lives completely and find the, the people that they feel most comfortable with to raise them, lift them up in ways that they never thought before. I'm always so happy to see, like, Singapore scene. They are trying to go back to the old way and show the legendary way.